Good morning, it's Frugal here. As always, I have my coffee because otherwise I might just get killed. Let's talk today about managing your money and statements. So you might know that from your bank that you get bank statements, right? Now, it's really complicated by times, especially when you talk about credits and uh, you know debits and all of these complicated things. The most important thing you need to know from this is that you need to understand that I have money in and money out. That is the crux of a statement. And whenever you ask for a statement, you need to make sure that you understand what is the money going in and what is the money going out. As a small business owner, you could just easily you know, just hand over your credit card or your check card and say, here you go, go and buy the things that you need. But it's so important that you keep track of that, that you know what money is being spent and how is it being spent and is it actually within a budget. Now, yes, I know companies also have a budget. Well, they're supposed to have, right? They're supposed to say, this is my expenses going out. This is my income. This is the projected income. But sometimes it does go a little bit south. I highly recommend having a good piece of software or something that you can track that with, whether it's an Excel, whether it's an online accounting system, but you need to know how much money is going in and out and what is the projections looking like. You need to know how soon are you going to be bankrupt. And if you are going to be bankrupt, I personally prefer not being bankrupt, but that's just me. So statements, go and check your statements regularly your bank statements, check your accounting statements, your money in and money out statements so that you can tell if there's any transactions that happened that should not have happened. It might be fraudulent. It might be that you just don't know what it is. Just ask. It's not that bad. Ask your accountant, what is this thing that's happening here? So that you can get a really good idea about what is happening in the money part of your business. Have a wonderful day and happy investing.